Hello friends in previous video I have show you basic of PHP data object, advantages and how to make database connection using PHP data object. Now in this video I will show you how to insert data into my SQL table and PHP by using this PHP data object modal. Friends this is my simple database name testing and in this I have table with name table employee with four fields like id, name, gender and designation. I will use this table for showing how many way we can insert data into this table using PHP data object. Friends first I have to make database connection, for this first I have to define host name username password and database name. For this I have write host is equal to localhost, username is equal to root, password is equal to blank and database is equal to testing. Friends we have used PHP data object so first I have write try and catch block. In this if there is any error in try block code then we can easily identify and catch block. First I have write code and try block, in this I have write my SQL database connection code. First I have write variable connect is equal to new PHP data object with open and close bracket and between bracket their first parameter like I have write database driver name my SQL with host is equal to server name which I have defined above after this I have write database name is equal to variable database in which I have defined database name. Second parameter is user name and last parameter is password, both I have already defined above. After this now I want to set the PHP data object error to exception, for this I have write connection string dollar connect with set attribute function, in this function there is two parameter. First is PHP data object with two times double colon attribute error mode and second is PHP data object two time colon error mode exception. Friends suppose there is any error in database connection or insert data so we can easily handle by PHP data object exception. For I have defined PHP data object exception at catch by writing open and close bracket and between bracket I have write PHP data object exception with defined by an object of this exception like dollar error. So friends if there is any database error occur so we can simply get error message by using this PHP data object exception object dollar error. But now I want to print her message for I have go catch block and simply write echo statement and use PHP data object exception object which is dollar error. So simply write dollar error with get message function. With help of this function we get specific error message. Now friends you can show database connection successfully done. Now I have show you how insert data into table by using PHP data object. First I have show you simple way to insert single record. For insert simple way insert record I have write one variable query is equal to insert query like insert into table employee with field name like game, gender, designation and values like Michael Bruce. Mail and System Architect. Now friends I want to execute this by using PHP data object. For this first I have write database connection string like connect with object operator and exact function with one parameter like SQL query which I have stored into query variable. So this way we can execute SQL query in PHP data object and now I want to display message like data inserted for this I have write echo statement with string new records inserted. Friends you can see that new records inserted message appear on this browser screen. 
friends you can also show in database records inserted or not. You can see that in employee table data are properly inserted into table. So friends this is the simple way you can insert data into database table. But suppose you want to use prepare statement of PHP data object for insert data into table. So now I have show you how to use prepare statement for insert data into table. Friends there is two way you can use prepare statement for insert data. In first way you can use name place holder in values and in second way you can use question mark into values. First I have show you insert records with prepare statement with name place holder. Friends first I have write one variable statement is equal to database connection string like connect with object operator with prepare statement and in this prepare statement I have write SQL query like insert into table employee with fields like name, gender and designation and values open and close bracket and between bracket I have write double colon column like name comma, again double colon gender and lastly double colon designation. So friends this a name placeholder instead of question mark, we are giving descriptive name preceded by a colon, we can pass values to the PDO statement execute method, in whichever order we like to pass until it matches placeholder names. Now friends I want to execute this prepare statement, for this I have write prepare statement which is store into statement variable with object operator with execute method. In this method I have pass fields data and associative array like this. So friends this way we can execute prepare statement with name place holder instead of question. For display message I have simple write echo statement with message like new records inserted. Save the page and show output in browser. Friends we can see that new records inserted message appear on the browser screen and you can also check in database table. Now friends I have show you insert data with prepare statement with question mark. For this first I have comment this code. First I have write variable statement, in this variable I have store prepare statement for insert record, so I have write variable statement is equal to database connection string connect with object operator with prepare method open and close bracket and between bracket I have write insert query like insert into table employee with fields name, gender, designation and values 3 question because we want to insert only 3 fields data. Now I want to execute this prepare statement so I have write statement variable in which I have store prepare statement for insert data, so I have write statement variable with object operator with execute method open and close bracket and between bracket I have write data in array format like this. So friends this way we can insert data into table with prepare statement with question mark. Now save the code and show output in browser. Suppose friends you want to insert bulk data into table using PHP data objects prepare statement, so for this I have make one array of employee data like this. In this array data you show there is three data of employee. Now I want to insert this data using prepare statement.
So for this I have write statement variable is equal to database connection string connect with object operator with prepare method open and close bracket and between bracket I have write insert query like insert into table employee with field name, gender and designation with values open and close bracket and between bracket I have write three question mark, three question mark means there is three fields. friends for inserting bulk records so I have use for each loop because with help of for each loop we can easily access all values, so I have write for each loop open and close bracket and between bracket I have write to rename employee as row. With help of for each loop we can access employee with reference of this row variable. In this loop I have execute prepare statement. So for this I have write statement variable with object operator with execute method open and close bracket and between bracket I have write fields value in array format like this. With help of this for each we can execute prepare statement with as many time without writing new insert query. Now friends I want to print message for this I have write echo statement with text new records inserted and save the code and show output in browser. Friends you can see new records inserted message appear on the screen and you can also see in table all three records are inserted into table. So this way we can insert bulk records into table by using PHP data object prepare statement. So friends this is my video on insert data into my SQL table and PHP by using PHP data object with different method of inserting records like simple or prepare statement with name place holder or question mark. So friends thank you for watching this video. If you have any query regarding this video you can comment on this video I will reply on your comment. Friends you want to get more update of my video, so, friends you can subscribe my YouTube channel. Friends you can also like my Facebook page also or you can also follow Webslisten on Twitter.